how to connect two Bluetooth speakers and use them both at the same time to your Samsung S22 Ultra phone with Android 13, One UI 5.0, and we're using a feature known as dual audio. It's not available on every Samsung phone, but mainly on flagship Samsung phones. And let's get started. The first thing we want to do is pair up the two Bluetooth speakers or Bluetooth earphones if that's what you're connecting. So here I got a Sony speaker here and of course I need to get this into pairing mode. I'll go ahead and enable pairing mode for this thing here to connect it. All right, so we'll go ahead and dive into our Bluetooth settings of our Samsung phone. You'll see the Bluetooth option here, long press it, turn it on and connect our device. Okay, we'll see that there. Okay, pair up, and that's connected now. Now I'm gonna go ahead and pair up my second device and you go ahead and do that. Okay, and these are two different types of devices out there. All right, JBL Go, pair, all right. Now, if your device does have dual audio, you'll notice that they both are highlighted in that specific color, okay? So we'll come out of here now, and there's a next section that we wanna to go to to enable. You see, every time you pull down your quick panel axis, you'll see these options here that says device control and media output. We'll need that option there. So in order to get into these settings or have them available all the time, once here, you'll tap on these three dots, and you'll see quick panel layout. So go to that, and you'll see device control and media output buttons and you want to tap on it and make sure you're set under show always so if you pull it down once or twice it's always there and ready to use now that they are here we have our two devices connected you'll also see it says two devices connected under the bluetooth icon here we'll go to media output and we'll now see this section here it's a view mode where we get to see these two options here so you wanna go ahead and select this circle here, go ahead and toggle it. And you'll notice now that there is two of them selected and able to control the volume on both of them. Now give me a second, let me set a song to play so you can hear them coming out of both of them. But before I do that, I'll just let you know that you can control the volume on both devices itself if they have their own dedicated volume functions or controls. And you can also control the volumes from here as well. Also, if you press up the volume on your phone itself, you'll notice there's two of them show up once your dual audio is enabled. And as you do that here, you can bring them both up together at the same time by pressing the volume up key or bring them down together at the same time. And you can individually control one to be louder. And as you're making the changes, it'll tell you which one you are controlling. So I'm currently controlling the JBL Go. And if I control this one here, it's the SRS XB12. Now we'll go ahead and play a song so you can hear them play. For some of us, we might know that it's not that sync, but usually doing it a second time may reduce the not so sync playback, all right? So here we go now, we can control one of them. This is the Sony. Okay, and this is the JBL. Or you can bring them both up together at the same time. And ladies and gentlemen, if you made it to this part of the video, you got it to work, like, sub, and thanks for watching. Once again, remember this feature is mainly available on Samsung flagship phones. Also check the A52 and the A72, those mid-tier models also have that feature. And thanks for watching once again.